NATO began large-scale preparations against a Russian attack. NATO passed a new defense plan at the Vilnius summit. The whopping 4,400-page document details the defense of critical locations in case of an emergency and lists a potential attack by Russia as one of the biggest threats, according to German media. The bloc's Secretary-General Jens Stoltenberg has welcomed what he called the most comprehensive defense plans since the end of the Cold War. The document addresses two main threats, Russia and terrorism, and accuses the former of being the greatest and most immediate threat to the security of allies and to peace and stability in the Euro-Atlantic region, according to Germany's Bild tabloid. German Chancellor Olaf Scholz also called on his country and the other NATO members to arm themselves against a threat to our territory, Bild added. The new plan also lists the military capabilities the bloc's members must demonstrate, including new member Finland and applicant Sweden. The document reportedly claims a violent and revisionist Russia could potentially attack NATO territory. We recognize that we could indeed be faced with an Article 5 situation, again, in which part of NATO territory is under direct attack, a military bloc official told German news agency DPA. To counter the supposed Russian threat, the bloc plans to massively increase its response force from the current 40,000 troops to over 300,000 compromising land, sea and air units, as well as rapidly deployed special forces. The bloc also plans to significantly increase weapons production and stockpiling. The new strategy includes a new defense production action plan to accelerate joint procurement, boost production capacity and enhance allies' interoperability, the NATO statement said. According to BUILD, the bloc would seek to build up armored heavy forces and deploy more long-range artillery systems and missiles, as well as air defense systems. NATO also plans to enhance what it calls deterrence measures by sending additional forces to the Baltics and Eastern Europe. Battle groups comprising 1,000 soldiers are to support the national armies of the Baltic states and Poland, BUILD reported citing the document. The UK will be responsible for Estonia, Canada, for Latvia, Germany, for Lithuania and the US, Poland, the German media outlet said. Berlin also plans to station a brigade of 4,000 soldiers in Lithuania, according to the German media. Germany is also reportedly expected to serve as the NATO logistics hub in case of a major conflict.